So you think it's him who'll crack first or the other one? No, the other one looks more twitchy. Mm -hmm. Robert? Robert? How's your dad? No change, I'm afraid. Ah, oh, well. Let me know if there's anything I can do. Yeah, I'll let you know. Thanks, Rodney. See ya. Tori's still asleep. Yeah. She was tired out last night. We'll drop it to bring us to hospital later. Yeah. I haven't got time to stop. Dad's put the kettle on. Uh, well, I can't stop. We just come to offer you some help, that's all. Help? Yeah, well, with a fan. Well, you won't be able to do much right now, will you? I think I'll manage. We saw the police in the village. I'll best get going. Dad's will do your brew. And you, make sure the water trucks are filled for the sheep before you go to school, right? See ya, bye! See ya. He don't mean it. Oh, of course he doesn't love. He's got a lot on his mind, that's all. We're not trying to say you did out, Miss Windsor. We're simply trying to find out what happened. You know this is really very good. I can't tell you, can I? I wasn't there. But you've known Andy Sugden for a while, right? So? So? Has there been any trouble between him and his dad? Has he said anything? Not lately. Meaning what? Meaning he's not said anything, right? If anything occurs, I'm on that number, OK? Thank you very much, Mrs Hope. Nice cake. So, what did they say? What did they ask? Stuff about Andy. Like what? Do they think he meant to do it? I don't know. Well, what do you think? I don't know, Mum, I really don't. Oh, it's all in the genes, if you ask me. Don't be stupid. Well, what's stupid? You know what his real dad's capable of. Call that coincidence, cos I don't. Where are you going? To get some air. Donna! Just... How is it? Nothing at all. Nothing. Where's Victoria? Katie's looking after her. I think it's a family and earlier flight. I told them it was an emergency. Well, you can't do anything about that now. I don't understand it. What the hell can Andy have been thinking? It was an accident by all accounts. It's terrible, but these things happen. Happens a damn sight too often where those lads are concerned. Maybe we should be going. Would you like us to come in with you? But if you can drop me luggage off at home, it'd be a help. Call us if you need us. I will. I'm not happy about lying while like this. We're not lying. Just not telling her for the time being. Same difference. No, there's a big difference. Oh, if you say so. Jack Sugden. Oh my God, Jack. Diane. How's he doing? It's going to be all right. Really. What the hell happened? It was an accident. Dad? Dad, can you hear me? Should we get a doctor? He's been doing this for a while. Drifting in and out. We just don't know how long it will be before he's fully conscious. In the meantime, we're very glad that the collapsed lung has reflated. But is he going to be all right, Doctor? Well, it's serious, but he's strong, he's fit for his age, and we're monitoring him closely. All we can do now is wait. I'm good at waiting, Doctor. OK, well, if there are any more questions, I'm just... Thanks. I'll know, Dad. See you later. Right, then. I want to know how this happened. Now. Just went off. 
Yeah. How can a gun just go off? Well, he doesn't know, does he? If he did, then he would have said. Oh, we're after rabbits. So the pair of you were supposed to be going shooting? Yeah. At seven o'clock in the evening? I was waiting for Rob. I don't know what happened. The gun just went off. Which is when I showed up with Katie. I wish I could say more, but it was just an accident. <laughs>